Hey everybody, Luca here, and today we're going to learn a new boogie bass pattern which is based on our boogie bass pattern number one. And it's just a little different and it sounds very cool. It goes like this, we have two times the interval, the, the fifth, and then two times the sixth. And now we play it in the swing feel, so it sounds like this. One, two, three, and... Okay, so let's try the bass pattern number two in our blues form in the key of C. One, two, three, and... Let's try it together with our... Um, Rhythm Boogie, we did in the first lesson, maybe you remember. So we have our uh, interval, the seventh and the third of our chord. And then our bass pattern in the left hand. One, two, three, and. Hey everybody! Today we're going to learn another single note boogie. It starts on the C and it goes like this. One, two, three, and... Two, three. Then we go to the four, to the F, together with our bass pattern number two, with the eighth notes with a fifth and sixth. That would sound like this. One, two, one, two, three, and. Hey there, I hope you still remember our single note boogie that we learned in the beginning of this course. And you can enhance your single note boogie or your improvisation a little bit if you add a sixth somewhere. So now I'm going to play that for you with our boogie bass pattern number two. And you can play along if you want or just watch and listen. One, two, three. our bass pattern, uh, our new bass pattern, number seven, which I'm going to show you now. The new bass pattern goes like this. And you go to the E flat, to the E, then to the G, to the C, A, and G. So let's try to play it in the whole blues form. You can play along if you want goes like this. One, two, three, and... What I do now for you is I play uh, our enhanced single note boogie with uh, the new bass pattern. 
one, two, one, two, three. I just played a very common boogie lick for you, or a common principle in boogie is you have got licks which always, which you can always repeat, and let's call them repeat licks for now. You have you start on the C, have a third E G, then F and A, and then E and G again and then C. And you can keep repeating that all day long and all night long. The cool thing about these repeat licks is, as I said, you can repeat them over and over again and it's really cool to build some tension in your, in your songs. I'm going to play it now with the boogie bass line number two. One, two, one, two, three. Hey everybody, today I'm going to show you a new intro, the one I just played in the introduction video. And this one goes like this. One, two, three. And the four. Hi everybody! Today I'm going to show you this outro, this ending, what I just played. So we're coming from the 5 again, so we're on the G. One, two, three, and... <laughs> 